All right, Brother Mook and I are loaded up, and we are heading out to Baldwin this morning to uh, meet up with our brothers and sisters and do uh, a little ride. So uh, maybe go downtown, check out all the uh, the vendors and, and stuff like that, but it should be a good day. So we'll see you guys down there. All right, so we arrived at camp. Brothers and sisters are having breakfast. Mook and I aren't able to stay the night. We got responsibilities. <laughs> but uh, either way, we're going to have a good time today. Let these guys wake up. They were up pretty late last night partying with, uh, I believe, the Thunder Roads people were out here. So um, it's going to be a good day. We've got a great ride planned. Probably head downtown Baldwin, look at the vendors, all that stuff. But uh, we'll talk to you guys in a minute. All right, so we're heading out to ride. All the boys are ready, and the ladies, and we're uh, we're gonna go down for a little club ride, and then uh, head downtown Baldwin check it out. So stay patient. Shit ton of people at the gas station here in Baldwin. Bikes lined up all the way around the corner. But there's uh, 150 bikes or more here right now. So we're gonna head out on a little ride. I'm not gonna record much of that, but uh, we'll still be stopping and balling a few other stops. So I'll see you guys then. All right, so we are here at the Freeman Inn somewhere near Baldwin. I have no idea where I'm at. I'm not familiar with this part of town, but we got the, uh, the whole crew here and some extras. We, we picked up some uh, some friends along the way, so uh, pretty cool. I'm excited to get in here and get this going. Um, I really wish I would have mounted this to my helmet because there was quite a few bikes. We went right through downtown Baldwin, and uh, I've been down here before, but I don't get down here that much. So um, it was actually really cool to see all those bikes and uh, all the people just getting along and having some good old-fashioned motorcycle fun. So. Check out this paint on this Victory. This thing is gorgeous. That's a beautiful, beautiful bike. Pretty nice. A lot of nice bikes down here. But uh, yeah, let's go inside and get something icy cold. Mook? Cheers. Yeah, baby. Cheers. Ice cold beer always uh, always takes care of the the man boob sweat you get going. But uh, we'll be heading out next to uh, another stop, and then uh, we're going to see what else happens from there. I think we're hitting a lunch spot too. All right, boss man says we're leaving, so we're gonna drink up and uh, head on out. Thank you. Definitely stop here though. Good place. Right, we are in Hart, Michigan, at Christie's Poor House. We got the whole crew here. We got some ice cream. We got all sorts of stuff. And uh, again, we are thirsty, but this time it's going to be a nice tea for the big guy. I don't like to drink and, and be on the road. All right, well, we have made it to Charlie's Bar here in Scottville. Pretty cool place. And of course, we got the line of bikes. All from our group here. So yeah, should be a, a pretty good time. Now we're gonna head back over to Baldwin and uh, go walk uh, walk around the festivities. I need to buy myself. I won't be able to make the, uh, 
the actual blessing, but I'm going to stop by and get myself a bracelet and a uh, challenge coin to help support the cause and uh, go from there. But uh, all right, we'll see you guys again real quick. All the cool stuff. Yeah. Leathers, knives, hammers, axes. Transaction on film, so we have uh, evidence. Hey, no. <laughs> <laughs> kind of wondering if they have this in a 3x. You never know. You get one for free. All right, so we are here at Michigan Bike Life, checking out all their products. Beautiful tent setup. Look at all this stuff. Saddlebag tethers, fishing lures, <laughs> earrings, all sorts of stuff, man. Good quality clothing, some badass hats. I picked myself up a few stickers. Of course, you got all this stuff over here. So you're at 70 bucks or 50 bucks. If you want, you can pick out a t shirt for 20 bucks whenever you buy it. Nice stuff, man. Carl's the man, too. He's uh, so if you don't know, uh, Michigan Bike Life is a sponsor of the Some Gave All Memorial Weekend Ride as well. And so, we're out here representing them and uh, saying thank you for everything they have done to help to help bring this ride together. So, it's uh, it's pretty cool, man. So, it's nice seeing uh, people I haven't physically met him yet other than just now, and uh, it's nice to actually shake his hand and uh. And I uh, get to know him a little bit. So, all right, on to the next one. We are at the Patch Guy. Look at all these patches. I was going to get my uh, Michigan Bike Life patch put on, but he's about uh, 45 minutes uh, wait time right now, and I don't have that kind of time. But definitely worth a stop come by and see this guy wherever he's at quite the setup we got leathers we got some canvas stuff we got some good shade stuff belts i mean all sorts of cool stuff so yeah definitely worth uh swinging by and, and checking out all right we're in another tent here this is the uh official unofficial lesson of the bike merch Got all sorts of stuff, all sorts of sizes. Ladies wear. Good prices too. We got uh, over here. They got ten dollars shirts. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Then they have ponchos. I've been thinking about doing a wool poncho for a while. on the Eagle Lights, so uh, if you're interested, go to www.eaglelights.com, use uh, discount code Northern Michigan Biker at checkout and get yourself 15% off those bad dogs. Look at this thing. We're gonna head over and get our uh, 
our wristbands for the blessing for tomorrow, even though we're not going to make it. We still want to buy them up and show some support. So. A lot of bikes, a lot of people, man. Good times. Alright, so Luke and I, we got our wristbands and challenge, and challenge coins. Let's see that bad dog. These things are cool. Nice. Oops, it's upside down. Beautiful work. Don't know where you Hell yeah. Don't know where you made. That's all that matters, man. It's coming out here. Even though we know we won't be here, it's just supporting the cause and doing that. And that's what a lot of people do. So um, it's only $5 for your, uh, for your wristband. To get into the blessing and uh, I challenge the challenge coin was like 10 bucks so you you can't beat that so all right we're gonna move on to the next one and uh, see what else we got well we made it back home mook is going home and uh I'm beat up man that was warm it was warm should have brought some uh, sun protection because I am uh, toasty red. But uh, yeah, all in all, it's a good experience. I haven't been down there in a while, and uh, I mean, seeing that many bikes, that many people together, was really cool to see. So, um, got to meet some people that were sponsors of the uh, of the ride coming up. Um, talked to them on the phone, chatted with them, you know, back and forth. But it was nice to be able to shake their hands and look them in the eye and say thank you. So. Um, that's it, man. We'll see what we can put together of this chaotic day and uh, make a video that makes somewhat sense. But if not, you get to look at some pretty bikes. All right, we'll catch you next time. Remember, ride with purpose.